Hello, fluffy people of the world. My name is Liquid Blitz, and welcome to Resident Evil 4, the newly released HD remake. Now, this is sort of good opportune. Oh, fucking stretching. Oh, I've just woken up. <laughs> this is good timing. I've recently finished Resident Evil 4, the original, uh, as a fully blind Let's Play on my channel. Um, I mean, in the past year. I've since played Revelations 1 and Resident Evil 5. Um, I'm halfway through Revelations 2, but I'm, I'm, I'm pausing that to do this. So I completed it quite recently, so it's still fresh in my memory with Leon and Ada and all, you know, and so on. So I'm, I've been waiting for this. This is not blind because I've played Resident Evil 4. Um, but it is blind in one respect. I have avoided looking at anything to do. Oh, fuck me, that's loud. I've, I've avoided looking at anything to do with this remake. I haven't even looked at screenshots. Um, some have been unavoidable, like I've been into the options, for example, to, to I've set all my settings up, uh, but for an example, when you look at some things, you can see pictures, and I've seen one of them is a picture of Leon, so... Uh, set, uh, these pictures aside, um, I haven't seen anything. I didn't play the demo on purpose because I wanted the graphics and that to hit me fresh when I jumped into the main game. So, so it's not blind to the story, but it is blind to all the online materials um, of this remake. So I, I've been looking forward to this. You've no idea. Um, I've been into the options. My graphics are set to pretty much maximum, including ray tracing, by the way. So this might just kill my computer. Like, not not bug out, not crash, just kill it. <laughs> uh, my frame rate might be really low, but I guess we'll see. Uh, for players who have not played Resident Evil 4, well, we know I have, uh, but I'm not doing hardcore. Jesus, I'm not crazy. Oh my god, I want the graphics to blow me away. This is one of the first games I've played that I've turned ray tracing on, by the way. I already love it. What the fuck was that? My desk is vibrating. Oh my god. Oh shit. I know which cave this is. Is my controller plugged in? Oh my god, I love the graphics already. Did you hear that? I'm playing with mouse and keyboard, but my controller is just plugged September in. September 30th, 1998. It's a day I'll never forget. Me too. The cop inside me died that day. And that night, Raccoon City was wiped out. Thanks to the bioweapons created by Umbrella. Mr. X. Somehow I made it out, but too many others weren't so lucky. Marvin. Marvin wasn't so lucky. Later, to join a top secret government program. Not that I had a choice. The training. Punishing missions. Nearly killed me. This is all completely new, and that's Krauser, mind off isn't everything. it? If I could just forget what happened that night. The pain. Even for a second. That was Marvin. This time, it can be different. Hey, the oh the to. the graphics, dude. Interesting music choice. That that was completely new, by the way. That wasn't in the cutscene for the original Resident Evil Four. Oh, so me, Yankee, that's Ashley. Why did you come to this horrible place, as close to nowhere that I've ever seen? To rescue the president's Say, daughter. Looking for someone. That someone must be very important, huh? The chief gave the orders himself. Help him, he said. I'm sure you boys didn't come all the way out here to roast marshmallows. <laughs> we we all know what happens to these two poor devils. These poor officers. Ooh. You have a strange sense of humor. I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. Just between us. A lot of people have gone missing around here. And it's been that way for a while now. We all know why. Well then. Should be just another day in the office. Right? His hair looks amazing. Mm. I mean, last week there was a search for some missing hikers. His mis his mustache looks amazing. Best to help me. 
Oh, this is what a remake should look like. There's nothing worse than when a remaster is basically not a remaster. This is a motherfucking remaster. I think this is it. Ooh, the lens flare. Nature calls, huh? I'll be right back. <sighs> yeah. I might try, try and turn the voices up. I've already cranked. ¿Te has bebido el bar entero? <laughs> I'd say be careful, but you're destined to die. <laughs> My um, poor officers. What a shine. Oh, it's the, the shine on his police badge is amazing. The shine on that creepy looking wooden pole is amazing. Oh god, is he about to get snatched by said villagers? Someone's peeping on him, taking a piss. That's not cool. I might have to tweak some volume settings because I've got no way of testing those before I start a recording. Um, policy. I really like the shininess of his badge and his glasses. Taking his time. Did he fall in? Maybe you better go and take a look. Dude's got golden glasses. You gotta be careful, or those are gonna get stolen. Wouldn't want to get a parking ticket. So much for helping me. Dude, you should probably come with. Or you're gonna end up nailed to some burning pyre. Poor guy. He seems like such a jovial, friendly cop as well. Oh my god, yes. Oh my fucking god, yes. Even the blurriness of the word chapter is cool. Ooh, yes. Let's let's take a... I've, I, oh, yes. Oh, fuck, yes. I've got to do this so I can get a nice close-up. That's, oh, that's a bit too fucking close. Come on, we've, we've got to get a good look at... Boy, you know, the, the one thing that I thought, as soon as I saw Leon's HD self in the options screen, how much does he look like, basically, like a two th early 2000s boy band member? This guy could have been one of the backing backup guys in NSYNC or something, Westlife or some shit. Boy band hair, like like I'm almost like a K-pop hairstyle. Oh my god, the resolution on his jacket. So just once again, all my graphics are basically maximum. As as near as makes no damn difference. Um, there's a couple of things that aren't quite maximum, but they're unnecessary. They're unnecessary over the top things. I, I, this is basically max graphics. You're seeing a 1080p representation of that, but you should still get an, a good idea. Of, of the quality. So far the frame rate is nice and smooth though, gotta say. Things like lighting and shadows particularly are all cranked to the max, so... You know, lighting and, and all the god rays and shit like that, that's all maximum. Oh, oh. I like the responsiveness of your... Oh, nice smooth circular run. Oh, this is a fucking remake right here. Oh my god. This is like... Where could he have gone? Oh yeah, volumes, hang on. I do like my voices to be louder than usual. As you can see, um, I, I, cr I turned down background music effects compared to voice already, but it's still not as loud as I would like it, so... I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. Voices are already maxed. So let's lower background music and sound effects by one each. And then raise my master volume. Let me know on... Let me... Give me some feedback with the uh, volumes. Challenges, tutorials... Okay. Let's find cop number one. Now the graphics are better, I can differentiate the two police officers. Um, if you see what I'm saying. So... When I see what I know is coming, I'll know which of those two officers is dead <laughs> on the on the burning pyre. Oh, hello, amazingly graphic dead goat. Oh dear, dude. 
A couple of settings I've turned off, um, and you'll agree with me. Oh my god, look at the birds! Maybe you should start recording in 1440p, because that's what I play at. Those are some big fucking ravens, Jesus. Look at the light, look at the light f on the wing on the one on the right side. When he, when he moves his feathers. Now that is how you do fucking ray tracing, oh my god, yes. Dude. So yeah, motion blur is turned off because fuck that shit. The, all the settings, um, which make things less clear. Chromatic aberration I've turned off because I hate that shit. Uh, lens distortion is off. Uh, motion blur is off. Everything else is maxed. So it's, you, it's, it's as clear and crisp as you will ever see it, basically. Oh, careful, all these barbed wires and stuff. Uh, oh, the one thing I didn't do <laughs> is... Ooh. Ooh. Zoom in on the house. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. They need to remake the first game with this new engine, I'm, I'm telling you. I know that technically there is already an a RE1 remake. That's what I did for the channel, but that's a, a very old remake. It's it's not like the two and three HD remakes. It was it was before that. I think they should redo the first game with this shit. Can you imagine? Oh, right, Leon, don't be stupid. Take the fucking meat cleaver or the shovel. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is such a treat. Right, there's a, okay. Um, skip ahead if you don't want to see a controls rebinding, but I need to change a couple. I should have done this before. I'm an idiot. Uh, da, 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 da. Um, key bindings. I cannot have crouch on E. What the fuck sort of a key bind is that? Uh, anything on C? Change selection on the menu. Oh, right, now. fuck that. Okay, that, that doesn't count. Da, 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 da. Right, where's crouch? Crouch, 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 crouch. Crouch, stand, or evade. Uh, I'll tell you what, I'll put that on C. The crouch has to go on C, I'm sorry, it does. But evade, if that's a dodge, I'm also putting that on my thumb, on my mouse, so... There, ooh. Oh, hang on, is that conflicted? Knife, ooh, ready the knife or parry. Space is fine, but I'm going to put that on the other thumb button. Oh, for fuck's sake, and the reload. Now, how do I get rid of that? I only want R for reload. Uh, delete is remove. There. That's good for now. I'll, I'll, I, I might change things as and when, you know, as and when I learn new keybinds, but C for crouch. Um... Oh, that, that evade thing is also quick turn. Okay. Right. If you're new to my channel, um, I mean, I'll put a playlist of my original Resident Evil 4 playthrough in the description of this video. You might want to watch that first, maybe. Um, oh, I can hear some sort of sound going on in there. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm actually going to raise my entire volume again. I want it nice and loud in my ears. It might be too quiet, actually. I guess we'll see. There's nothing going on right now. I don't want, me, I don't, I don't want to fire my first shot with a gun and it blow your heads off it so loud. So let's leave it as it is. Oh. Ooh. Anyone home? Look at those light rays. Look at that motherfucker. Ooh. Ooh. What's that? Uh, I mean... Um... Oh, right. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Uh... How, how do you rotate? Let's get used to the keybinds now, because I'll be doing a lot of this shit. Right, so I can spin, and I can also rotate. Okay. Se acera el juicio. <laughs> so, something el juicio. Judgment is nigh. Juicio is judgment. 
Or nigh. Okay. Understood. I thought that was legit saying something was juicy. Like, I'm no bullshit. Oh my god, look at the lens flares on the right side of the screen. Oh. Right, okay, let's pick up the pace. Yeah, I was saying, if you're new to my channel, I, uh, I, I try to be thorough in these games. Now, this is not a blind let's play, so to speak. I mean, it kind of is. I'm, I'm assuming this will have significant differences to the original. Not just graphics, but also maybe sections of the map will just be completely new, maybe. Things like that. Certain bits will probably have been removed. So it's kind of a blind... A blind let's play, in, in a sense. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna take my time and enjoy. Hello, villager. Sorry to barge in like this. Yeah, sorry. Is he going for the cleaver or something? He speaks Spanish. Mm. I wonder if that's why Leon was sent, because he speaks Spanish. His hair is beautiful. This is a beautiful hunk of a man. <laughs> oh, oh, that's the mustachio gentleman who went out for a piss. Good dodge, Leon. Oh, what a fucking kick. Right, this is too loud. I'm going to turn one, one notch of volume back down again. That's fucking blowing my head off. Is that said police officer? This is not good. You know what? I'm gonna leave the volume as it is. Um, Hunter's Lodge Key. I, I... Yeah. I might edit the volumes for you guys. It's, it's loud as shit to me and I can see it going into the red on my volume meter on my recording. But, uh, but then the voice voices are sort of perfect volume, so... I'll leave it as it is. Man, that stinks. Oh, that is proper like that pot of goop from Resident Evil 7 in the kitchen when you first get to the Baker house. Oh. Oh, the crosser gets smaller the longer you aim. Oh, that's good. Oh. oh. Even the fucking UI is nice and crisp with its nice crisp edges of the boxes. Oh, here we go. See what's taken- Oh, you can't see the quest objective under me. It doesn't really matter. It just says, see what's taken so long. Um, combat knife. Let's just, uh, let's just examine the, uh, textures. <laughs> the lighting, the glint of the light on the blade. Graphics have come such a long way. Is that- is that ring for your thumb or something? To make it easier to- to shank a motherfucker. Ooh, look at this. Uh, you got a little graphical representation. Power, durability, attack speed. A weapon suited for close encounters. It has been Leon's go-to receiving it during his time at the Raccoon City Police Department. I really appreciated that um, new, new cutscene at the beginning of the game. It gave us flashes of what the hell Leon's been doing between two and four. Now, I don't remember that when I first played Resident Evil 4. As far as I'm concerned, the last time I saw Leon, he was escaping the police station when I did the 2 remake, and then flash forward several years, like six years or something, and we're suddenly in Spain. But that cutscene bridged a bit of gap there, He so we learned he joined a secret organization of some kind. And I'm pretty sure with that red beret, I think that was supposed to be Krauser. The bastard fucking Krauser who kicked my ass <laughs> in, uh, yeah. So, I was going to say, that was in 4, wasn't it? That's coming up, isn't it? Oh, I'm looking forward to that. Right, okay. Let's just, let's just, uh, oh, kendo. Oh, you can zoom! 9 millimeter, 9 by 19, ooh. Now that's a pistol. You can even see the fucking serial code on it. Ooh! Oh, is that S and F thing? Is that your safety switch? I'm from the UK, where 
guns are basically fully illegal. Um, so I, I, you know, I don't know a damn thing about guns, really. Ooh, there's your first aid magic spray. Ooh. Um, no treasures. Oh, you've got your mix. Oh, you know, what? people complained for so long in my original four playthrough that I didn't keep mixing three herbs, and I should have. I kept mixing two, and this is your, your handy chart of what to do with your herbs. If I remember right, yellow increases your health permanently. Oh, look at this. Crew charm. Mission brief. Ooh, this is probably important. Um... Yeah, let's just read this. Overview, the Retrieve the Kidnapped Individual. Oh shit, no. Subject, Ashley Graham, age 20. Daughter of US President. How is that not more global news at this point, unless it's like completely fresh? University student, see photo for physical appearance. Background, contact was suddenly lost with the subject as she made her way home from campus. Oh, so she's going to like a Spanish university or some shit, like college. You see, I didn't know that from my original playthrough. Soon after, she was she, along with her ex-military bodyguards, were reported missing. Upon further investigation, it was determined that she was kidnapped by an organized group and a team was convened. Our intelligence department has confirmed several sightings of the subject in a remote village located in a mountainous region of Europe, Spain. One agent was specifically chosen for the task. Additional info, we have confirmed that the perpetrators received help from an insider. Isn't that what's-his-face? Um, yeah, it's only been like six months, but I've forgotten his name. The swanky cowboy. The, the swanky Spanish cowboy with beautiful long brunette locks. You know who I'm talking about. Uh, that must be him. I don't... Uh, what's his fucking name? I, don't, I, can't, I can't remember. I just remember he was a beautiful man. Uh, local law enforcement abroad. Can we see the picture? I actually want to see the picture in big. Um, oh. Right, okay. Well, I'm looking forward to seeing her representation. Right, okay. Let's get on with it. Hello. Oh, there you go. Officer's badge, National Police Corps, Mar Mario Fernandez Castaño, police officer. Oh, you can't rotate this one. Hang on. Uh, uh, well, we know he's he's bleeding. Policia activo. Right. Any other clickables? That's another thing. If you're new to my channel, I love me some clickables. Oh, it's so horrendous and beautiful at the same time. Right, okay. Now, let's leave the room. Uh, let's just get used to this shit. So you've got you've to ready your wep- Ow, oh, that's it. I can do that with space or with a mouse key. And then you just stab. So left mouse is shank, right is- whoa. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. Gotcha. Well, that quick turn key will be used. Oh, if I remember right, isn't it true that you couldn't strafe in Resident Evil 4? And that was one of my biggest problems with it, having played some of the newer games. I was used to being able to strafe. It looks like you can strafe in this. Yes, you can. Oh, hell. I remember all the Ganados, that's the name for the zombies, um, they tosh knives at you and shit, and, and I would always have to do this, run to the side and like dodge, but now I can just sort of strafe. Um, let's practice the evasion now. Um, <laughs> okay, that's, the evasion key isn't, it, it's... <clears throat> Hasta el fin, viveramos together. Okay, I, I'm part Spanish actually. I just don't speak it. Oh. I know a few words. That symbol is everywhere. Isn't that the symbol of um, what's his face? Uh, now hang on, just one moment. Can I go back again? <laughs> Sorry. Just bear with me one sec. So we came in here. I thought I missed a door, that's all. 
Um, right. Okay, yeah, we're, okay. Let's go. I'm looking forward to seeing the big fuck. Um, I just kept calling him big fuck. I, I don't know what his name is. The village chief, who's like seven foot tall. Oh my god. And I remember what he becomes as well. I'm looking forward to that. Woo! Hello, little rat! Hello! What a cute little horrific rat. Oh, is this gonna be, again, one of those times where I've gotta shoot crows and stuff and it drops loot? Every Resident Evil, I'm forced to kill the animals for, for the loot. Right, is that the police radio I can hear? Mm. This is everything I hoped it would be so far. Look at the particles in the sky, for fuck's sake. Hey. Oh, is that one of the officers? Is that moustache officer or friendly officer? It's moustache officer! Oh, that's the... What's your situation? His, his situation is getting knifed and... Right, and so I'm guessing if this is a moustache officer, friendly lazy car officer, must be the one that gets strung up in the village square. Oh god, that means I've got to shoot something soon. Oh, oh he had his throat slit. Ow, ow. Um, is there a flashlight key or is that just on by default? Um, can I... If I left click, does it shoot or knife? Oh, it knifes, thank god for that. Okay. Well, hang on, which way did I come in? You see, this is the problem with cutscenes. Oh, look at that. That's ray tracing in action right there. The light isn't going past the, uh... Oh. Now, hang on. Um... This is a dead end. Shall I turn the FOV up? The field of vision. Or view. It's fine for now, but I, I, I've got a couple of notches from maximum, so I can always turn that up. Um, I don't want it to feel too zoomed in. Right. What was that shuffling? Hello! No fucking way. Look at his head. I'll knife you, motherfucker! I'll knife you! I'll knife you! Knife him! Knife him! Knife him! Knife him! Knife him. Leon! Knife the motherfucker! Hey. Right, okay. Okay. In every Resident Evil game, the, the damage of your knife weapon, your melee, differs wildly. In like five, all the melee prompts are a major part of the game. No, I'm just, I've gotta shoot the motherfuckers in this game. The knife did fuck all. <laughs> um, now, does that knife have a durability? It's got a, it's got a bar, and I used it for self-defense. Then it does. It fucking does. Um, uh, durability level one. Oh, I wonder if I can upgrade your durability. That's definitely durability. I reckon I've got two more self-defense uses. Um. Hello? Oh god, oh god, here we go. Hello? Donde estas? I'm over here, motherfucker. You see, I, I do know some Spanish. Like, donde estas is where are you? Well, I'm gonna kill him. Am I, is this a waste of ammo? In OG Resident Evil 4, you, all the enemies did drop shit. That one looks friendly. That, that one looks like a village elder, you know what I mean? Um, is this a complete fucking waste? I've got six bullets. <laughs> this is not... Uh, can I save it? No, okay. This is not opportune bullet usage. Oh, is that prompt? 
Does that prompt mean I get a melee um, prompt? You see what I'm saying? It is. F to- Oh! Oh yes, all the prompts are back from the OG f Resident Evil 4. I forgot for a second, it wasn't just Resident Evil 5 that had the prompts, it 4. 4 was the first game with the prompts. Right, okay, you better believe I'm gonna be conserving ammo and kicking motherfuckers throughout this whole game. Cool. Although they haven't dropped any loot. One of the, one of the best things in Resident Evil 4 was that, um, you know, resources in, resources out. You, you, you go out of your way to kill motherfuckers, you get loot from killing them, you know? Uh... Is... Hang on. Can I go out the window? For no real reason than fun? No. Oh, you can smash the glass. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's all coming back to me now, and you can shoot, like, leg, arm, and head for different melee prompts, if I remember right. No. No? Okay, right. <laughs> That's not the way out. Was there some, uh... No, okay. Let's just run around like a maniac till I find something. Oh! Hello! Oh, it's me first herb! Cool. I'm guessing you can consume one simple herb on its own for a tiny bit of health. But I'll save it. I'm gonna be so damned professional for the rest of this playthrough. I'm not gonna get, get hit again. I'm not gonna get a stick of dynamite near me. I'm not gonna get knives tossed at me. I'm gonna dodge like a motherfucker. I love the shininess of his jacket, even. Ooh. Who is that? The new graphics, I can't tell who it is. <laughs> this is Gondor 1. Hunnigan here, what's your sit rep? Ooh! His daughter, Baby Eagle. It's likely she's in this village. <laughs> Baby Eagle. Our intel was correct then. Well done. I like her curls over her glasses. She may have been taken there. Copy that. I'll see what I can find. Hurry up. Something's happened to the people here. My escorts are... One is dead. <laughs> Gotta go. Talk later. Oh, fuck me. Um, yeah. I don't have the bullets. Out. Oh! Oh my god, he's Superman. <laughs> Oh, I remember now. His Superman dives out of, like, upper floor windows. He's crazy. And Ada is the same. 25 foot drop, no problem. He's got a golden zipper. Oh, fuck. Yes. Right. No, I missed a few bits in the original game. Like, I think there's a moment ahead of me in the original game, where you can go back inside a building once you leave it after a cutscene, and then you have a little moment where you see Ada or something, and I missed that in the, my damned original playthrough. So I will be checking everywhere out. I'm so curious how similar the layout is going to be. Like, I don't remember crossing a bridge. Or do I? There was one gem that I missed in the original playthrough. And it, it was... It was the one that you can't go back to get once you cross a, th a th certain threshold. Um, I don't even know if there is going to be, like, gems in trees and things in this remake. I'll just keep my eye out for any glinting. Um, right, I've got to do it one time, because the, the the crows slash ravens do drop loot in the original. I really don't like shooting animals, even in the context of a video game. But I've just one time, just, you know, if they've got loot, then I've got to get it, you know what I mean? I'm not trying to get killed with lack of loot here. 
There we go. You see, why is a what? What's a what's a poor raven doing carrying around a little tub of gunpowder? You know what I'm saying? Bullshit. <laughs> Motherfucking devs getting us to kill animals. So, so this just means I've got to kill literally every animal now. Right. So from here on out, I apologize for my killing of very, very realistic, high definition, like 4K ravens and animals. I, I don't like it. But I'll do it. <laughs> I don't like it, but I'm getting this motherfucking loot. There we go. Reload. Oh, is this a, a future? Oh, we got a map. If you become lost, you can check your current position and objectives on the map. If you have a treasure map, you'll also be able to see the location of hidden valuables. Now, one of the things you get when you buy the deluxe version of this game, which I don't have, by the way, in addition to a bunch of costumes and shit I don't care about, um, I've seen some of those costumes and they're ridiculous. Uh, you would never, you should, you would never use them if you're trying to have a serious playthrough. But uh, one of the things you get from the deluxe version is a treasure map, and I think there was some controversy that that's locked behind a paywall. So I might have to compensate by being extra vigilant. Um, I'm already very thorough with my searching, usually. I mean, it, off now, we'll do whole once-overs of an entire area once I'm finished before I progress to the next area, and I'll edit it down for YouTube. Um... No, it doesn't show us our objective, and that's that's fine. You know, I don't want too much uh, direction. Um, I see all that shit's back there. I, I was blocked off, though. I couldn't go back. Um, well, let's keep looking around. I'll just really be mindful of gems, especially motherfucking gems in motherfucking trees. Because that, that, the one red, I think it was the red gem specifically. It still haunts me. And I bet, yeah, this is a shortcut from the other side. Ooh, okay, let's save. Now, you don't need any ink ribbons, do you? Jesus Christ. You know, I've just remembered there are blue medallions in Resident Evil 4. This was the first game with the medallion, so I've got to be looking out for those. I don't care about attaches and charms. This is what you get in the deluxe version. I don't, I don't care. Um, I don't care about shitty little extras like this. I just want the core game. Saving an item storage. You can save your progress. You can also swap out weapons in your inventory via the storage menu. Let's look at storage first. Right. Uh, this didn't exist in OG Resident Evil 4, did it? This is one of your quality of life things taken from seven. I'm okay with that. Um, hell, it'll save us a lot of space and shit. Oh, look how much space you get. Bruh. This is an example of, like, the extras. You get, like, a gold attaché case and there's another one. Who gives a fuck? Like, like who gives a fuck? It's just a, a inventory space. I mean... Ah, right, all the tabs are up here. You got your save games, you got your storage, and you got your attache case. So I've got silver and gold. Um, I, th I did get the pre-order bonus, so that I might have got those for the pre-orders. And you get way more shit for the deluxe version. I mean, do I just click it? I mean, it's, n it's a nice colour, but I don't give a shit. <laughs> so, oh, can I not unequip? I guess you get the silver one by default then. Let's just throw in the gold one just because I've got it, but, but let it be known that I don't care about shit like this at all. Now as for your charms. What? You get bonuses for that? Plus 30% handgun ammo craft bonus frequency. I got this for pre-ordering. You see, I don't like that when you, it's like pay to win. I, I don't like that. But I'd be a, a stupid idiot to not equip it. <laughs> uh, equip right? I don't know what that means. Oh, right. Okay. Well, I'd be a fool to not equip it, but I don't like that. Okay. So we're, we're done and done. Let's save it. 
Chapter 1. 5 p.m. Standard. Head for the lake. Okay. Oh, the fucking lake. It's all coming back to me. The shit that I'm gonna have to face in this game. Case in point, the fucking lake monster. Oh, I wonder how that segment's gonna go down. With your harpoons and shit. Oh my god. Sorry. It's wor- well, I mean... Okay, right, okay, that's the last time I'll apologize for killing the animals. I I'm gonna have to kill every fucking animal. You, you understand. And it's worth wasting the bullets, because some of them will drop bullets. Uh, let's pick this shit up fast. Pesetas. Ah! Was the currency in the original Pesetas? I think it was. It was just abbreviated to Petus. Yeah, it was. Oh, that didn't drop anything. Um, I'm not going to test how long it takes shit to despawn, by the way. Because in the original, once an item was on the floor, you had like 60 seconds to pick it up and then it was gone. Let me know in the comments if you would, uh, if shit does also despawn. Oh, I thought it was like a sludgy pit. Um, wolf? Oh, look at that! I mean, it's creepy, but... That looks so good. Can I zoom in more? I want, I want zoomage. I want zoomage to look at the bird's plumage. <laughs> oh, the, the, the wolf got trapped in a bear trap. Poor thing. I mean... Oh, can I unlock from this side? No. Okay. Poor wolf, but I would kill the wolf in a heartbeat if it uh, showed any aggression. Because I know there are wolves coming up. Dude, this must be a very old building if a tree has grown out the fucking bottom. We're talking- that's like a 300 year old tree, man! Okay. And it looks like one of those birds would have uh, flown away had I not shot the second one really fast. So, uh, yeah. Let's shoot birds pronto. Right, they're running away from me. I think he's running to the village opening, isn't he? Uh, can I fall into traps? Hey, that's telling of the time period of this game, because Spain switched from pesetas to euros in, um... I mean, it must have been like 2007 or some shit. It must have been it was quite a, quite a long time ago, but I guess after the time setting of this game. Hmm. Hello. Right. Let him get close. And let's melee. Right. Leg shot. No. 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 Okay. Leg. Legs. <laughs> Leg thing was not a- Fuck! Can I hit one into the other? Yes, I can. Oh. Whew. Right. Oh! Oh, I saw that. I saw that. It used your ability. Right, okay. Um, I wonder if I get a stomp prompt at some point, because that was a lifesaver. I'm a bit concerned that shooting the leg didn't get a unique uh, uh, melee prompt there. But it, it is what it is. Let's roll with it. I can hear something. I wonder, what was the evasion key again? I've got to check. Um, because I want to see how easy it is to evade a knife instead, just to really save on your, uh, bullets. N ready knife parry, so that's, that's what I've been pressing, that's the wrong thing, it's crouch, isn't it? Yes, C. And hang on, didn't I put a thing on that? I could have I could have swore I changed that fucking keybind. I was wondering- I was wondering why the fuck it was quick turning when I was pressing my, what should have been my evasion key. 
There. Are we good? I'm being betrayed by the controls. Right, okay. Um, space. Shit! No, 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 no. Fuck. Right. Okay, now let's just quickly... And it is... It is, um... You see, it just crouches. It doesn't have seem to evade. Uh... No, it just crouches. I wonder if I've got to press it, like... Like a timed thing. Like, the, the moment you get lunged at, then press it, maybe. I see you down there. I see... Yeah. Right, sorry about that. I just had to restart my recording. Just to make sure there was nothing wrong with the footage. Right, let's continue. I can hear a bird or something. That's no bird. Um... Ah, yes. Can you do sneak attacks? I'm... Um, you know... Hey! Fucking hell! He's the one sneak attacking. That was ambush. Right, let's try evading. It's just... There's never been a better time to practice, you know... Oh! Okay, the evade key did not work. Let's try an arm shot. No. Right, it's headshots. Okay. That's fine. Headshots only. Um, you know, it, I might be confusing four with five. I know that five had the leg and arm shots. Like, they made, they gave you different prompts to a headshot. Fuck, do you see the axe wound that just vanished? <laughs> okay, Leon is actually Superman. Right, what the fuck is that evade key talking about? I pr it, it's the crouch key at the same time. That did not evade. <laughs> um... Unless you've got to be officially sprinting to do it. Now you see it's not doing anything. No. Right, okay. Okay. That's that's fine. Between episodes one and two, what I'll do is I'll come around I'll I'll load the game. Um I won't progress at all, but I'll I'll practice moving and stuff. Um Ooh, let's mix my first herb. Flash grenades. Horribly underutilized in my original playthrough, because I know that they kill the tentacle boys instantly, don't they? Uh, scroll wheel. Oh, I don't have to press the numbers, I can just use the scroll wheel. Um, ready to throw. Can I- oh shit. Okay, item crafting. Certain materials such as resources, gunpowder and knives can be used to craft different items. The types of items that you can craft can be increased by obtaining new crafting rep recipes. Learn to read. Okay. Restoring health. You can restore health using herbs or a first aid spray. The effects of herbs... <laughs> Red herbs increase the amount of health recovered, while yellow herbs increase your max health. And you can mix all three for a super duper bad boy uh, thing. Setting weapon shortcuts. You can set a shortcut by selecting the weapon in the items menu. Up to eight weapons. That is such a fucking upgrade. You've no idea. Eight versus four things. That is so good. That's a hell of an improvement, let me tell you. Um, well. Uh, okay, you got your map. Oh, it saves the location of your shit. That's nice. Um, officer's badge. Comms log Hunnigan. That was the cutscene, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay. Right, let me uh, look at the mixing things. Ah, it's black if you've got enough to actually do the craft. Um, is there a green, red, and yellow one somewhere? Yes. I mean, I don't need to heal right now. Or am I talking shit? I might, I might be talking shit. Uh, oh, you can split it between ammo, misc. Grenades and shit? Right. Let's hotkey some shit then. I want to put knife. Knife doesn't need one, but pistol can go on one, I suppose. Grenade, I want that on like five or six. All your grenades and weird shit. Mines or whatever. That's five, six, seven territory. So let's let's uh, register shortcut. Do I click on it? Yes. Nice. I tell you what, five will be frag. <laughs> uh, I'm pressing the wrong thing. Well, um, I'm a noob. Six can be flash. Five frag, six flash, seven 
special. Fire, fire. That's seven. Okay. My health is actually dog shit, I've just seen. Ooh. Oh, you've got like a wheel arc. Nice. Yeah, let's mix the herbs, because... Uh... Oh, you can't just combine. You've actually got to go on the... Oh, that's... No, that, yeah, you can. That's fast. Ooh. Let's use it, because I'm less than half health here. One more axe to the face. Or the shoulder, and I'm dead. And it looks like I can upgrade my health by double in total. That's nice. Okay. Um, I wonder what you got to mix with gunpowder to make bullets then. Just real quick, real quick. It requires a blue thing. Okay, I need one blue. I'm guessing that's some sort of chemical agent or something. Right, let's go. Dude. Oh, that's probably previous police officers. I'll try and make- Oh, one of the heads fell off! <laughs> oh, what a nice touch. Oh god, I wonder what his name was. Jeff. Poor Jeff. Oh, this is the village, isn't it? The, the, the layout is the fucking same. And that is- that's the friendly police officer. The friendly but lazy police officer from the car. Um, zoom. Oh, the fire looks nice. Oh, he's alive still! Oh, shit. Oh, I forgot this detail. Leon, you should you should put a bullet in his head, Leon. Why are you still staring at him? Oh, he's dead. Okay. I'm glad he died fast. I think it might take you longer than that to die in real life. Fucking hell. I don't remember that detail. I thought he was just dead. I remembered him dead on a pyre. Oh, that's horrendous. That's like Outlast territory, watching someone burn to death. That's a nice axe. That looks like it's got a nice sharp edge to it. Oh, well, look at all that. I don't see villagers to, to kill. I, I see bags of loot to, to collect. <laughs> I'ma kill him. I'ma kill him. Look at the models as well. Completely different character models for each one of them. Uh, I take that back. That guys are that these guys are twins. But yeah, ooh, with a cardigan. And yeah, that guy's got his flat cap. But they're still, you know, he's carrying buckets. They're still, you know, carrying out like village chores. You got your chickens. Oh my god, I forgot about the eggs. I forgot about the eggs, so I've got to kill the chickens. Wasn't there a cow in this village as well? And I didn't kill the cow in my OG playthrough because I didn't want to keep killing fucking animals. I think it took me ages to kill my first chicken, even. Um, but I, I guess I'll have to shoot the cow. Um, I wonder... Officially, then. If you can sneak attack. That one's facing away. Let's try and sneak attack that one over there. I think once I rile one, I rile all of them. Please tell me there's a sneak attack. Uh, there is, but it uses durability. I'm, f I'm fine with that. Oh, Leon, you cold-blooded bastard. Keep in mind, they may be dangerous like brainwashed fools. Um, they're more than brainwashed, they're infected by the Las Plagas Parasite. Um... Which I think was the precursor to the, uh... Didn't it become the Ouroboros... ...virus? I can't remember if it was directly related or if it just, like, the research of Las Plagas led to Ouroboros just generally. But there we go, resources, let's craft a gunpowder. Okay... I'm not, I, I, I hate it when knives and like lockpicks are like a one-time use thing or, you know, you get the idea. So I'm going to have to find more knives or learn how to repair or some shit. Right. I want a thousand handgun bullets because I need to headshot these fuckers. If I am to kill them all. 
I love the fact we can do sneak attacks, though. That's proper nice. Um, well, I can just keep sneaking around, I suppose. There's no one over there. I could just go full ham, but... I mean, I, I hope you understand and can appreciate a stealthy approach. It will inevitably go to absolute shit. I'm surprised he didn't see me. It, it's going to go to shit in about 10 seconds, but I want to try and get some knife stealth kills just because I can. And if I remember right, round to the left, you go there much later once you've already gone, Ashley. Yeah, and we go that way first, I guess. Oh, the bell tower. I forgot about that. At least we've got a nice big village to play around in. Okay. The game hasn't shown anything to do... Oh, fuck me. The game hasn't shown anything to do with blue medallions yet. Oh, I, you know, I forgot there was a merchant. Welcome to the crew, lad. No, that's that's uh, that's Pirates of the Caribbean. What, what does he say? He's got a similar voice to, like, Davy Jones. <laughs> Welcome to the shop, lad. And I didn't know for the longest time until someone commented that it's voiced by the same guy that does Leon. Which is hilarious. Shows a great sort of range in uh, vocal ability. Because they sound nothing alike. Do I need a lockpick? Yes. I guess I don't have to sneak inside. Let's not go so slow. Ooh, already. Already. Um, let me look at the craft menu. What can else can I do with blue? Shotgun shells. Ooh. Oh, you need a certain number of gunpowder. It's not just one gunpowder is one craft. Right. Isn't there a shotgun in one of these buildings, actually? So, you know what? I'm going to hold off and see if I can find a shotgun. It might even be this fucking house. Is that not a thing? No? Okay. Ooh, right, okay. Let's, uh... Oh, shit! Oh, God. Was the smashing glass because... Was the smashing glass, uh, the officially no? I'm here. Oh, dude, listen to the sound when they're inside. They make a unique, echoey sound once they've gone indoors. Ooh. Here we go. Why? Oh, fuck. Here we go. I, I saw that on the wall. I saw it on the wall. I'll, I'll loot everything once I've killed all these guys. Let's loot everything. Just in case it disappears. Oh, yes. No! Oh, oh, she's got a mean hook. Let's get some distance. Let's get some distance. Oh, we got a ruby. Fuck you, you missed. Um, I want to group them together if possible. Oh fuck, they're behind me. Let's run past them. Oh fuck, they're fast. They're fast as shit. I don't want to get boxed in. Yes, that's what I'm after. You missed. Sorry for the shoddy camera work. What's that? Oh god, there's more. I need the shotgun, dude. Right, let's go to where I think a shotgun is. Look at his eyes! Keep Fuck! I think this thing let me climb. Let's climb up. I can't, I can't climb, we can't climb up. Um, if I remember right, there was a shotgun in this... Uh, this building. There was an upstairs window in the shotgun house. It might have been le it Oh, right. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, man. How cinematic! Yeah. 
It might have been Ada that gets the shotgun in this house. In separate ways, the DLC thing. Um. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Ooh, I love the sin. Okay, can I kick the ladder down? Upstairs, let's kick the ladder down. It's my lucky day. There's the shotgun. Let's um, kick the ladder down real fast. If we can. Knock down. There you go. Right, shotgun. I love the fact that it's in the same place. Oh, nice. Um, any loot? Yes. Fuck me. Right, okay, okay. Let's do one quick thing. Fucking. I appreciate the oh shit of the background music, but it's, it's a bit fucking loud, isn't it? Two notches down, and then I might uh, put it up again later. Right, okay. Real fast. Grenade on five. It's important. You gotta have your, your shit correct. I've got this. This is this is what you call a perfect funnel. Please Yes, Superman out the front door. Whoa! My knife is nearly dead. All that matters is I've got the shotgun and I'm, I've got all the open I can run around in. Make, make sure I've got all the loot. Fucking hell! Frag grenade. Fucking hell! Yeah, he's tough. Whoa, the cow's on fire! <gasps> oh, the bell! Okay, what the fuck? What's with the flaming cow? Flaming beef? That's completely new. I didn't want to... Did, did I do that? I didn't want to burn the... I'd have preferred to shoot the cow. Oh, they are proper, like... The, be the bell is proper mind-fucking them. Like they're all hypnotized. Lord Sadler. We heard the name there. Lord Sadler. I come to suck your cock. Okay. Well, whatever takes the heat off of me. I love that I, that I remembered exactly where the shotgun was. That was uh, a lifesaver. Now I've got to know. Please let me know in the comments. If that burning cow that gored the chainsaw guy was was scripted and was always going to happen, or did, or did I do that? Because I threw the frag grenade very close to that barn where the cow is. Where's going? Bingo. Ha 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 ha! Leon with his fucking jokes. How is he not shitting pants? He just fought a village of maniacs, and he pulls out like a James Bond quip. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh shit! Bruce Seconder One, I've identified a route to the lake. Look for a large windmill. There's a path on the far side of it. Windmill. Copy that. Shouldn't be careful. Bruce out. She looks like an actress. She has. She looks. She has the spitting image. Look. She. She looks exactly like an actress, but I cannot put my finger on who. It's um. I can see a face flashing in my mind. Um, what the fuck do I know her from? Um, put, I'll, in, a, in the edit, I'll remember and I'll put her face on screen. So, yeah, this is the barn, famously, where the cow is just munching on the, the hay or some shit. Now, did I do that? Because I tossed a frag grenade here and it, like, set light... a light to the barn. Let's loot his shit before it goes. 300 percent is nice. Poor cow! I don't relish the killing of these creep. Oh my god, yes, I don't have to kill the chickens. They just lay the eggs. Oh, thank god for that. I'm g oh, there's, you got you, you got your cock there. Your white ones, you got your brown ones. Um, I'm not going to kill them now I've seen one lay an egg. Because that's like, re that's like uh, renewable energy. <laughs> that's like renewable resources. Right. If it turns out I said that cow alight, I'll actually be gutted. Uh, 
Hilarious, though, that... Actually, it'll straight up be hilarious, actually, if I did do that, because I just basically found, like, a cheat code for killing the first chainsaw guy, who were notoriously tough as shit in this game. And I got a cow to gore him. Now... I know for a damn fact that in the original there was a there was a shiny shiny on this roof. So if there's no shiny shinies here, um, granted it was Ada's segment and she needed the grapple hook or some shit. Um, but you get the point. Ooh, oh, this must be more like. Oh no, it's just sewage. Okay, right. Let's sit rep. Let's reload and do all this shit. And I should have enough shotgun crafts now. Right, let's keep saving. Because the shotgun is my shit in these games. Um, I always love a good, the good, the rifle, the shotgun, and I tend to like try and upgrade those as much as possible. Um, that said, I am recognizing the fact that the pistol is the ultimate stumble tool. You know what I mean? Like, one headshot, and then I can I can wait for, like, three motherfuckers there. Melee prompt one of them, and I, I kick all of them. So, yeah. Actually, I might want to consider... Oh, I could have... Uh, yeah, I could have given myself an easier time. I'll try and strike a fine balance between what I craft. I'll be crafting the... Uh, Pistol stuff, not for damage as such, but I'll craft the pistol stuff for, for melee prompts, funnily enough. And the shotgun ammo for just raw damage against tough ones. Right, well, this was once a lovely sort of small town home. Ooh, ah, ooh, I could have done with those shells before. Mm. Now, actually, hang on. Wasn't this is the exact time that people once told me that once you get the shotgun, if you just go on about your way, you people told me that you miss a small cutscene between Ada and Leon if you come back into the shotgun house. Now I've come back in without even thinking, and I didn't see Ada anywhere. Um, I wonder if that's just not in this remake. Let me know in the comments. <laughs> Amongst everything else in the comments. Oh no, that's a, oh shit! I should have left, left that up. Uh, any more shinies? Uh, it looks like gems aren't a thing. Because I haven't seen a single shiny yet. We uh, and I'm pretty I'm pretty damn sure there was a a shiny on this roof. <gasps> there are shinies. Um, that wasn't shining. So I'm guessing the shinies don't shine. Which is a problem. Um, ooh, I wonder if you're just going to get close in this game and just see the prompt. Um, let's jump down. Oh god. I'll try and be fast with this sort of shit. Because I don't want to waste your time. But I want to be thorough, like loot every gem so I can buy every upgrade, you know? It's probably, you know, upsetting, though. You can always... Yeah. You can always skip ahead. YouTube is quite user-friendly these days for scrubbing ahead. But I've got to loot everywhere. Ooh. Let me turn my fan on, because I'm a million degrees. All right, I've been going for over an hour. Ooh. Times are ticking. Couldn't you go higher than this? Oh! Fucking Jesus! Ooh! Fuck. I've just remembered before I fell to my death. <laughs> it wasn't it actually Ada all along who rang the bell to distract them from killing Leon. Ooh, hello. Hello. Okay, oh yes. Okay, yellow paint equals loot. Understood. Oh, even the the buildings are even the same layout. Oh. 
Any loot? I'm hoping there isn't that sort of situation that you get in Resident Evil 7 where you can't see the even the prompt for some loot unless you're like crouched and looking very close to it. Like, do you remember those antique fucking coins? You've some you've got to be really particular with where you look for those. Right, so that building looted. Cow building looted. Ooh. Um, what's in here? Oh. Okay, this is, uh... Oh, we need Ashley! Ah, that must be... Yeah, teamwork. Prompts. Okay. I'm trying to remember where we get Ashley. Right, I think we've done everywhere. Oh, Falcon! Ugh. Fucking Jesus Christ! Ah. Stop scaring me! Did he call me a conejo? Isn't that a rabbit? Or a conyo? Right. Okay. We'll 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 be back later. Clearly, with Ashley at some point. Okay, well, Jesus. Fucking hell. Right, any more uh, promptage out here? No? Oh, hello. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, it's actually, like, burned away to, like, bone. Proper skinny looking. These people are sick. I'm surprised his hat is still there. Oh, that poor bastard. At least they didn't, like, eat him alive. That would have been worse, I reckon. Okay. I think we're finally good to go. Looted, looted, looted. Uh, let's go. I apologize if I'm missing any Ada secret cutscenes. I, I did go back inside Shotgun House and there was nothing, so... I'll be extra vigilant going forward. Pretty sure I need the key to get in there. So, let's go. Any sneaky sneakies or shiny shinies? Ruby. The first ruby I got from just a, a regular zombie, it looked like. Hmm. Dude. Reflections. I've got ray tracing on, so it should actually reflect actual shit to a degree. Um, at least uh, lakes and bigger water surfaces do. I'm looking forward to the lake, just to see the reflections. I ain't kidding you. That and the big goddamn monster in the lake. Okay. Let's go. Lord is Adelaide. There it is. Ooh, windmill. I see the big old windmill. Oh, hang on, isn't this our introduction to dynamite? <laughs> In about two seconds. I'm hoping you can shoot the dynamite as they toss it. Right, can I, uh... Fucking hell, it fills up fast, doesn't it? Christ. Uh, I need 12... Shot, uh, 12 thingy bobs. Okay, you get enough ammo if you loot everything. To, you don't need to craft. Jesus. Like, ooh, I, can you shortcut first aid? I don't even consider that. No, you can't. Uh, I wonder if there's a healing keybind. Right, good time to save. Uh, let's just do a little bit of... A little bit of something. I mean, I'm swimming in eggs. Let's put sort of like backup shit away. Like I've got three green herbs. I know I can mix three, but it's fine. Um. Oh no, can I? I don't want to discard it. Can I? Hang on. Oh. Ah, it's only like weapons. Oh, right. Hang on. Store. Craft. Craft. Oh, it's just weapons, that's why everything else is greyed out. Okay. Okay. Alright. 
kind of a shame you can't store excess herbs and shit. Uh, and fish. I remember you can get f fish which, like, fully heal you from the lake. Mmm. And some of those things were massive in the inventory. Oh, it is. Oh, I know where we are. It's not the dynamite village yet. That's in the future by quite a ways. Don't see me. Don't see me. Don't see me. That's a white egg. Doesn't that heal more? How quietly do you vault is the question. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. Even if the, the other ones see me. Right. Nice. 500 pesetas. Okay, we've got a cow again. Chickens, we know not to shoot because they lay eggs, but what about the pigs? Uh, oh, hang on. Isn't this, isn't this where that fucking trap thing is? Where the, the, you get the pendant, but it, it gets dirty if you shoot it down too fast. Um, right, none of them can see me. Oh, it's, it's closed. Is that, oh, that's hilarious. It's not a thing in this remake. Like all noobs, I got the, the pendant dirty in the original game because I didn't shoot the th the lid closed and it fell in the dirty shit water. But it's, uh, that's funny. It's not in the remake. Alright, okay. Let's, let's crawl up behind this woman and knife her in the throat. Like the cold-blooded fucking killer that Leon is. It's just a, it's just an elderly village woman doing the, the garden. And Leon comes along and does this. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. That is a pri that's a prison kill shank. That's not your regular shank. That's a kill shot. I can see that medallion from all the way over here. Um. Oh, I can see. I can. I don't want to give myself away with a gunshot just yet. Hello, cow. Are you gonna kick me? Um, I'm not sure when I'm going to stop. I've been going 40 minutes plus 30. I've been going like an hour 15 at this point, hour 10. I'll keep going because I do not want to stop. For, for shizzle. <laughs> for shizzle. Hang on. Cow. 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 <gasps> you bastard cow. I'm on your say You killed the pig. Oh no, it's still moving. It's still twitching. Calm down, cow. Why the fuck did it go ape shit? <laughs> fucking hell, pig! What the fuck, man? My health is fucked. I'm getting farm animaled. Seriously, let's just pause a moment. Fuck, Jesus. Okay, so I don't know. Did did I knock over that bucket and, and make a noise, and that startled the cow, or did I simply get too close to the cow? That was legit, like, I pissed the cow off, so it rammed me and the pig, and then the pig got pissed off, and it, it fucking hit me out of revenge. You know what I mean? I, I startle cow, cow hits me, cow hits pig, pig hits me. Like, the fuck? What the fuck are these animals? Um, well, I've gotta, I've gotta shoot one pig. Oh god, I died, I... Oh, 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 right. Okay, that one is, is not a thing. That was the pendant last time. But it looks like it's here this time. Well, I ain't no fool. I ain't no fool. I love the use, use of yellow, letting you know what you can interact with, like boxes and shit. Well, I've clearly got to shoot that thing down, but it's going to fall in the shit water. Now, that looks like a little water shoot to me. Can I turn it? It almost looks turnable. You know, these... I know how these work. That's a wind vane. Th this thing can turn directions based on what direction the wind is blowing. I wonder if I do this now. Oh, God. Um, how realistic is this? Because if I shoot it around here, it's going to fall in. But if I shoot it on the right edge, it should miss... Is that a thing, or is it just- is it destined to go in the shit no matter what? 
I can't turn it, can I? I wonder if once you come back later when you've got Ashley, if the wind has changed or you can do something new. Um. Mm, I'm not sure. We'll come back to it. I want to clear this area first of, uh, of shit. There's nothing in there. Let's clear this area of enemies, then I'll then I'll handle all your blue tokens, your farm animals, and I'll make a decision on that treasure. It's an important decision. Right, so let's see if the cow just attacks you, if you get too close. See how I'm touching it. I'm in it. Okay, okay, okay. So you can't get too close. Well, it's a good thing I've got so many fucking eggs. Calm down! You bovine bitch! Oh, this is a good opportunity to look at how much... Uh, they heal. Okay, white takes it... Takes the health dial to about... Just under half... Over halfway down. Brown is... Oh, hang on. I'll do the... I'll click real fast. No, that, that didn't work. Huh? I think brown is more, isn't it? Fuck me, that's uh... Brown is more. Let's just use that, and that. Off. Oh, bless the chickens. The chickens are friendly. Fuck the pigs, fuck the cows. Right, let's go. I've wasted enough time. What was around the back here? Okay. Won't open. I'm pretty sure in the original there was a blue medallion up there. <laughs> I think they're in different places. Right, let's uh... I wonder if you can switch so, uh, shoulder side, you see what I mean? Like we're to the right of Leon. In some, some of these third person games you can switch it. So you can see around corners easier, you know what I mean? Uh, Um, I'm just pressing any old shit. Uh, no, okay, okay. I'll check between episodes. Oh, we need a special key. And there's a treasure. You, I remember you get that from jumping down. Okay, let's go inside. Oh, uh, oh, we've got to, uh, We've got to do some climbing. Can I climb up here? No. Do I just have to go forward first? Well, I mean, I don't. I can't see. I'll just shoot. I'll treat this as my moment to do all the shit because I don't think that he can get to me. One. Don't they star? Right. Fuck you, cow. Calm down. I know that I saw a blue thing in the barn. I know I did. Didn't I? Calm down, pig. Oh, I should have shot them when I saw them. I could have sworn there was a blue thing in the barn. There. Oh my god, that's fucking hard to see. Two. At least three of them are in this area alone, which is kind of odd. Uh. That's one, two. I saw a third one from miles off. Un forastero. Un forastero. Oh, somebody let me know what that meant. Um, I always thought it sounded like Forrester or something. Whoa, head straight off. But yeah, it sounds like you're calling someone a Forrester or something in Spanish, but it's, I think it means outsider or something. Un forastero. Oh, that's not a medallion. But that is. Un forastero! Okay, what's this note say? 
Oh, destroy the bl blue request notes. You can take on tasks by collecting the blue request notes posted around different areas. View the requests you've taken from the files menu. Destroy the blue medallion. For the love of God, will somebody please get rid of the blue medallions? I'm the man for you. Those religious lunatics left hanging around. Request, destroy all of them. Area, farm, reward, spinel, X3. That's the lowest form of gem, but I'll take any gems. Three out of five. It says the farm. Now, in the original game, it was the whole area. It, you had like 13 total or something, and it was this, it was the village, it was before the lake, and all, all the connecting areas. So it counted for everywhere, but it, it looks like these five are just the farm alone, which is interesting. Because I reckon they're all, all five. That, they must all five be in this area. Yes. Okay, right. Let the surge begin. Um, I can't get in this building, I don't think. Until we go around, etc. Slightly different layout. This whole area on the left was blocked off before, and you had to go across the bridge to drop down into it. Other way around here. I'd like to say I'm not going to be precious if I if I miss some items, but I think I might be the most precious guy you ever met. Uh, if I miss something, I might even have to reload just to get it. Um, I am precious. Now, see if I can't go back. Right. Okay. Okay. Um. I've got four out of five before even going inside. I've got a feeling. The other one will be out here. It might be inside, but let's check outside first. I've got the barn one. I haven't had anything... <laughs> yes! Victory! Right. It, right, I'll, I'll say again, it's perfectly logical that the wind would change direction when, once you get Ashley later, and this will be in a different position. But come on, do you see what I'm saying? If you shoot it, it it's lined up off the edge, so if I shoot it like now, it should miss. I'm gonna- I, I love to go with logic, so I'm gonna do this. Yes, please. Yes! Yes, I get a- I get a clean- Pearl pendant, it's not covered in shit like last time. Oh, you've got to love it when logic actually, you know, wins out. In court, they say truth will out. In a, in a video game, logic will out. Right, I'm sorry, it's got to happen. It's got to happen. One, it's a one time thing. Avert your eyes if you don't like this sort of thing. Fucking hell, that's one resilient pig! I'm sorry, but please, have you got any loot? Right, if it's got no loot, I'm never killing another pig again in my life. Okay, right, lesson learned. Pigs are a no-no. I mean, this is a different colour pig. What the fuck?! Did I just kill that with Jedi powers? Oh, it's moving. Never mind. Right, okay. Pigs are a no-go. Cows... That's actually interesting. There were two cows. There was dos cowos. <laughs> so I don't know what the Spanish for cows is. There was two cows, but there's only one now. Where the fuck's the other cow gone? Because if it died, I want to see if there was loot. <gasps> Ooh, don't ram me. Um... Okay, again, this is this is a one-time thing. I killed one pig. I the the cutscene with the flaming cow doesn't really count because I don't know. You know what I mean? This is a one-time thing. I apologize. Any loot? Right, I, that looks like a no. Okay, no more pi no pig killing and no cow killing for the rest of the game because there's no loot. I've got to kill crows, and I've got to leave the chickens alive for the eggs. We're learning. You've got to. You've got to. You, you. Come on, don't don't blame me. Don't, please don't hate me. <laughs> Can I disarm? 
Leon is a professional soldier. That is dynamite right there. You know it's old school weaponry when there's actual sticks of dynamite. Yellow herb, ooh. Um, I might wait till I get a red one. I can mix the... Huh. Now you can, you, once you craft one, you can actually craft it in, like, you can add a yellow to a, a green and a red later. But once I craft it in this game, I think that is a crafted item and I can't add to it. Let's try doing a green and a yellow. But I'm going to save it. Even though it increases my health, I'm going to save it until I get a red one and there's a red one right there. <sighs> I should have gone to the opticians. Can I add it to that now it's crafted? Um... I can't, uh, uh, oh, hang on, I've got the red and I've got that, yes you can. Nice, they've covered all their bases, thank god. Um, we're full health, like I said, even though it increases my health, I might as well take a bit of damage before I take that. No point in wasting it. I need to win the episode soon. This might end up being like a two and a half hour episode because I don't want to stop playing. Like I'm not kid kidding. Right, if I know anything about Resident Evil puzzles, I clearly need a massive cog. Oh, you see, all the other cogs have square centers. I need a cog. Does he say something if I try and click on this? Understood. I love the the sort of very stone. It's almost steampunk without being steampunk. Just machinery. Very cool. Right. Ooh, is this where I can get my special drop down shit? It is. Very cool. Have I got 12 gunpowder yet? Nope. Yes, I do. Okay, craft some shock and shells. Boom, and then we got multiple slots free. Hell yes. Um, what's this gonna be? Is it just gonna be like a... It's, uh, it's you know, it's all flooding back to me now. The treasures, you had like cats, cat statues that you had to put colored gems into the eye sockets, shit like that. I wonder if they're gonna keep it more simple in this game. Combining? No, no, it's not. They've got the full treasure combining system. You can view the treasures you've collected in the keys. Oh, some treasures will just... some treasures can be sold at a higher price. Oh, you better believe! <laughs> I'll be getting every fucking one of these. Um. Now, in the in the original, I learned that things that end with the the word gem are used for combining. It, it was either gem or. I think it might have been cat's eye or something, but everything else was just sellable. So I don't think the like velvet blues, spinels and stuff you can just sell. Um, oh, I can actually put them in. Oh. Um, it looks like it's got two slots. Can I put any gemstones in? Oh no, it's a certain gemstones. Okay, well, I'll wait till I've got more. In the original game, you had this flagon for ages. I'll wait at least until I've got, like, two different color gems. But I'm wondering if you can actually just go with any color you want. Alright, anything else while I'm here? Um, we get up there soon. Let's... I just heard a zombie, a zombie, a zombie. I'm wondering if, you know the lockpick thing we got in the in the village area? I wonder if Ada's the lockpick person? Um, right, I've just got a second ruby. Now is that gonna let me... Uh... I really hope I... You see, it's round, but... I wonder if this would sell for more, because I think reds are the shittest ones. If I put, like, a couple of yellows in there, does it sell for more? 
I'm going to wait, actually. Ooh, another knife. Uh, oh, shit. Um, I'm glad I made some shotgun ammo. What up, bruh? Um, do you have any grenades? I do. There you go. Fuck! Oh, did I kill it? Oh, thank God for that. I thought I might have a melee prompt. That's not a thing, that's not a thing. Oh, once they do, do that sitting animation, they're dead. Right, okay. Get them all! Nice! Ooh, yes! Gunpowder Potatoes handgun ammo. Nice! Right, what's this about? Um, do I have to... Do I have to move that thing out of the way? Uh, I'm, I'm guessing something smashes through there at some point. Okay, let's go up. Um, but as I was saying, I reckon that, that sounds about right that the lockpick stuff is Ada's, um, you know, thing. I assume there's going to be a remake of Separate Ways where you play as Ada. I assume. Because lock, lock, um, lockpicking doesn't seem like Leon's kind of thing. That seems like an Ada stealthy thing. Okay. We're almost done with this area. <laughs> Finally. You see why I'm so fucking slow. <laughs> I just like, I just want to see everything. Take it all in. Um, now before I leave forever, I think we got everything. Let's go. Medallions, com check mark. Pendant, check mark. Flagon, check mark. Gems, check mark. Satisfaction with the game so far. Check mark. Dude. You know what I need in my life is like another Skyrim remake with this graphics and this engine. Can you fucking imagine going up into the mountains and fighting dragons with these graphics? I know there's some amazing mods out there, but not not this good. Hang on. What the fuck am I doing? Let's not be stupid. Um, right, okay. Oh! I forgot there was a big gate and I forgot that I had a cogwheel now. <laughs> Apologies, I'm a bit of an idiot. Right, let's cog this motherfucker. And let's get through to the next area, then I'll call it an episode. Dude, the fucking resolution of a simple cog wheel is amazing. I might have to just uh, get, uh, title this episode. Hairy man gets blown away by modern graphics. <laughs> right, let's jump back down, I guess. Oh, no, no, hang on. Did we crank the soldier boy? Uh, yes, we did. I like the realistic um, inertia with movement as well. It's not just instant movement. It's actually like, uh, you know, you've got some weight to your character movement. Now, that, that was there in the original Resident Evil 4, but not nearly as good. What with the fact that you couldn't really... Turn like you couldn't turn for a start. You you were always f moving with the camera direction, so you couldn't strafe. But yeah, look at the weight of your guy. It's uh, it's realistic. It's nice, and it it it's gonna be much more realistic with dodging attacks and stuff. You can't just magically zip away from a melee attack. You're gonna get hit if you're not timing that shit correctly. Okay, right. 
I've enjoyed the village area. I've enjoyed the farm area. Now let's enjoy the bridge. Does this shit fall down and then I run away from a boulder? I hope I'm not missing anything. I'm so gonna miss some shit. Ooh. I'll only really be upset if you can't... Ah, we can move that, okay. If you can't, um... Go back to certain areas, just like the original. Because then I will just miss stuff and I won't be able to go back. Pretty sure Largo is Spanish for lake. So we're going to the Largo. To, to, to meet El Gigante, that big motherfucker. And, um... Well, I know I've got to go to the lake, so what the hell is this direction? A dead end, that means... Loot. Oh. Uh. Well, I can see that area down there. That's proper logging... logging camp. Oh, what's up here? Nothing but a glimpse in is up here. Okay. Um... I mean, was it just for those pesetas? There's gotta be something more. Oh, we got ski lifts- Oh, hang on! Hang the fuck on! Uh... That rings a bell, a ski lift segment to go down the mountain. But I, I thought that was quite far away in terms of layout of this land. Maybe they've changed the layout. Well, let's go. Oh my god. The fucking light running through these bushes. Well, let's head this way. I, you know where I kind of want to get to before when I end the episode? I want to be in front of the place that Ashley is inside of, the, the church. It's well before the lake, so I know, it, I, I'm pretty sh sure it's, it's very soon. So let's go. Um... I think it is, anyway. Although, we haven't had that whole segment with the, the the fancy Spanish cowboy yet. That might happen before we get to the Ashley Church. <laughs> oh, fucking what the fuck? What the actual fuck? Well, I dodged that bullet. Oh shit. Oh shit. Let's, um... I missed. I missed my knife. I'll take your th 300 pesetas, thank you. You missed. <laughs> that was a, a no-look dodge. Right, okay, so they can jump off there. I I'm getting the feeling like this is the... This is the segment where you're supposed to run from. You, you have to tap the key. And you run from the boulder in the original. You know what? This, I've got plenty of bullets. Yes, you can shoot them. Oh, just like the original. Whoa. Apologies if you see that happen every now and then on my recording. I took an axe to the face. You know, I'm wasting ammo here, but... uh. Yeah, every now and then, for some reason, my my recordings do that. Fl it flickers on, off and on really fast. Um, not sure why it does that. Yeah. Technical problems, am I right? Usually once I restart my recording, uh, that stops happening. Right, let's not waste ammo on these motherfuckers. Um. Oh, yeah. Fucking hell, they've got the throw of, like... Well, someone with a good throw. Jesus. I've still got my full heal, uh, health boosting thing to use. Fucking hell! Oh my god, they're actually really good. Should I shoot them? Just for completion's sake. Maybe they drop some loot. 
Right, they are so much better than they were in the original. My god, they're actually landing shots. That's what happens. Yes, loot. Okay. Yeah. This is definitely the, the same passage where you run from the boulder. I wonder if there's going to be any boulder running. Huh. I guess not, because we're, we're already down at the bottom of this. Yeah, no. This this was the boulder hill. Oh, it's a shame. It's a shame. I'd have loved to have run from a boulder. Um... Uh, what the fuck is that? Way Shrine? The blue thing was there, the barn was there, the cow shed was there, that, that's this village. What is that? That wasn't the treasure, the treasure was out there. What is that? Um... Can I go back? This is- okay, this is one of those times I'll, uh, I'll skip forward for you guys. Well, I'm back. I've got to know what that gem symbol was. Oh, right, okay. Okay, right. It's that special key thing. Well, it's nice to know that shows on the, uh, on the world map. Let's zip back forward to where we should be. And we are back in this big, scary cave. Ooh, ooh, you know, my game just lagged a little then. I wonder if it's all the, the shadows and the lighting effects clogging up the brains of my machine. Um, fuck the bats. Oh, okay, the bats are immortal. Good, okay. So, that's, that's a check mark to the bats. I can't, I, I, that's, my, I've got a checklist in my head of animals you can't, or should, I'm not going to kill. Pigs, check mark. Cows, check mark. Bats, check mark. Um, chickens, check mark. Crows are on the kill list, but so far those are the only animals on the kill list. Kill on sight list. <clears throat> right, this... Uh, this is looking creepy. Am I really that close to the fucking lake already? They have proper changed the layout of this. Un unless... Unless that's the church right here. Because I remember the layout. The church was at the top of the map on the original, and then you had to go sort of down and around, and it was a long path. Then there was a big area with a gigante, and then there was another long path. It was, you know, it was quite lengthy past the church. But I think the lake might be right, right behind the church. I hear a bomb. And I feel like I've missed an entire area. Unless I'm losing the plot here. Oh, this might be... I think I can hear dynamite. Oh! Oh, that's not good. I fell for the trap. Hook, line, and sinker. I'm gonna back off because I swear I can hear dynamite sizzle, uh, sissing. Sissing? Hissing. That's the word. Yeah, that's what's exploding. Okay. Right. Let's, um... Fuck! Oh my god, there's too many enemies to back off. Damn it. And now's a perfect time. I've, I've got no knife. No wonder I can't do the self-defense. Now's a perfect, perfect time to keep dodging dynamite. Oh, fuck me. Oh, I can vault over. Okay, right, back off. Let's back off for a second. I'm going to use my health increasing... Herb. There. Perfect time. Nice. Right, reload. You missed! So they Right, I've got to kill these dynamite motherfuckers. Um. 
Oh, I don't have a knife officially. What about that kitchen knife I looted? I know for a fact I looted a, a, a second knife. Unless I've used it already. Right, the dynamite isn't as easy to see in this game. Oh, I've got somebody climbing. Where's this fucking... Where's this dynamite motherfucker? Oh, for fuck's sake! Oh, God. <gasps> fucking hell. Dynamite is right into this woman. You know, I can't- I keep forgetting I can't knife. Shit, man, I keep forgetting I can't knife. Um. Oh, fuck. Um. Oh, I tell you, without the knife, you're fucked. I can't knife barrels or loot. Um. Uh, well, let's kill these motherfuckers. Oh, I can kick the barrels, okay. Oh my god, the, the tension, the, the stress is getting to me. Fuck it, hell! Oh my god, they've got the throwing accuracy of, uh... I can't think of a baseball player. <laughs> Just someone with incredible accuracy. Some sort of baseball pitcher. Right, I see. Right, I've got a... I've got just the weapon for you. Light another one, motherfucker. I dare you. I double dare you, motherfucker. Right, I know where the, I know where the dynamite appears now. That it'll be easier to shoot. It's up to the right. Throw another one. Throw another one. You're fucked. Your life is over, wench. I mean, sometime today. Come on. I've got to do this. I wonder if I can shoot the actual stick that isn't a light in her hand. Oh, well, yes and no. I missed the dynamite, but you can actually just stumble her and then it's too late <laughs> for her. Okay. Right. Jesus. Let's inspect that broken knife real quick. Looks like it can be repaired, right? I wonder if you can get, like... Regular repair kits, that sort of thing. Well, let's craft way more pistol ammo. Hey, hey, let's do two. I've got plenty of shock and ammo for now. Okay. That looks like a thing. <laughs> Whoa! Um, yeah, I've got no choice but to shoot these because. I can't knife them. Uh, oh, I can go up and round, right? Let's go up and round before that loot disappears. Uh, can I go up there now? Let's dodge the fucking thing. Climb. I need to end the episode. What am I doing? I'm, I'm be I've been going too long. You just keep throwing your dynamite, sir. So it's one woman the whole time. Oh my god. Ugh, she's got moving tentacle boys coming out of her breasts. She's got breasticles. Breast tentacles. You need to learn to throw better, dude. I'm going to teach you what an excellent th shot looks like. Come on, bro. I've got your number. <laughs> okay, you can shoot it. I just missed with this lady. Right, okay. Any treasures while I'm up here? You never know. Did Leon just, just give a very smug... <laughs> I would if I was him. Ooh. Later in the game key? Yes. I wonder if Ada gets that key. That kind of rings a bell. Uh, so do I really have no 
Fuck me, the lake is right here. Okay, this is one hell of a different layout. Right, this must be where she is. I guess. That's str that's funny. The the layout is much more compressed than the original. Like it was about now that we came to In fact, let, let's call the episode here. Um yeah. Cuz the uh, the layout is confusing me. I wanted to like get to the church in the original game's layout and then I was going to call it an episode, but yeah, I'm I'm already at the fucking lake. Um so it looks like they've compressed the layout of the map a lot because I know they did this for the 2 and 3 HD remakes I haven't played the originals and I do plan to at some point um, but but I heard that especially the 3 remake was way short like entire sections of game were removed in the 3 remake it's looking similar um, in 4 um I'm loving it so far, but they've definitely changed the layout or shortened the layout. I only played Resident Evil 4 the one time blind on this channel, and I've never played it since because I've, I've been working my way through the games one at a time. So I only played Resident Evil 4 once, so my memory isn't going to be as good as a lot of you guys who have seen and played Resident Evil 4 many times. So you'll let me know in the comments like if I'm right about the layout, but at this point... Hadn't we run into the Spanish cowboy guy and the big village chief guy before getting to this lake area? I thought that was all previous to the lake. Unless I'm completely wrong and it's after the lake. Um, unless I'm wrong and it's after the lake. Because I thought by this time we'd, we'd already seen... A uh, uh, we might have even seen Ada by that point. Um, let me know. Because I feel like a lot of things are different and we've missed uh, a, a lot of the old game segments. Mm. I know for a f I mean, we're at the fucking lake right here. And this looks big as well. This is a battle arena. So this this is the, the lake right here. Um, and before you reach this, like a long run away from the lake. A long run, because it, it's it's up and round the path, and then you've got like a watery segment where you're sort of in waist-high water, loads of villagers, a whole gameplay segment, and then you've got a long path from that watery area all the way back to... Um, there's an offshoot, and the, the, the merchant is there in a side room, isn't he? And then, then you have that big open area with the Gigante, the big fuck, which we get introduced to later. And then there's a shoot all the way around the mountain path, like jumping over the bridge bits, all the way, so that's a super long path, and then you get back to the church, where Ashley is in, where, where we haven't reached yet, uh, and, and we're already at the lake, so it's like there's an entire long track of gameplay removed. Um, so that wasn't the church, that was the dynamite introduction. Um, door with insignia. Lakeside cabin. Okay, well, uh, I guess we'll find out. That's going to be part of the f the blindness and the fun of doing the remake, seeing how different it is. Hope you enjoyed the first episode along with me. I'm actually loving this shit so far. It doesn't bother me if they shorten gameplay segments or change the map layout or whatever for gameplay purposes or, you know, let's keep it real in this day and age. A lot of the younger audiences don't like long, lengthy gameplay segments. Um, you know, it's it's a well-known fact at this point that the attention span of the youthful generation is non-existent. So that's why they're shortening a lot of these games. It's not to remove lots of gameplay for you to do. It's just that the kids, the 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 G Don kids these days have the attention span of a fucking fish. And uh, so they, they want all the snappy big moments of the game faster. You know what I mean? I would have loved for it to be the exact same layout as the original, same length and everything. But I'm more than happy to have a completely new take on the 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 pace of the gameplay. As you've seen, I, I am no stranger to slow paced gameplay. I take ages to do anything because I want to check everything out. I want to loot everything. You get the idea. Um, but I know that's that slow speed and being really careful to make sure you lose everything. That style isn't for everyone's taste. So apologies if you're frustrated with my uh, pace 
if you're one of those people that kind of just wants to get to the story moments and reactions a bit faster. But this is how I play these games. It's how I enjoy them the most. You see, if I just breeze through here, I could have done this shit in like less than a third the time. Not even twice as fast. I could have done this several times faster. Breezing through the village and the farm, etc. Killing and just looting the main stuff. I'm sure most YouTube playthroughs will be like that style. Because my sort of style isn't very good for viewership. It's too slow. Um, but it is what it is. It's how I choose to play these games, and I hope you can appreciate that. Um, like I said, the, 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 the jumping backwards and forwards on YouTube now, just by double tapping the screen on phones and whatever, it's so fast and easy to like jump ahead now. Um, if you keep tapping on the right side of your screen on your phone, you start to jump forward by like 30 second chunks. So you can, you can, it's easier to jump ahead in slow playthroughs. So keep that in mind, maybe. Like this video if you liked it. Like this video if you didn't like it. And subscribe for similar content. All my social links are in the description. Discord is the main one. Come and talk to me there and join in the fluffy fun. Uh, and I have a Patreon if you want to go above and beyond to support my content. I'll catch you guys in episode two, where I'm guessing we run straight into Ashley. Um, I guess. I'm looking forward to seeing Ashley's character model, let me tell you. Anyway, I'll catch you next time. Liquid Blitz, 